Jamus Pueblo Mai de Shkij Orno Oven Bread. Kis Ani Biba Yat Etene Masana Nishlen. Today we are going to have another video. This video is going to be regarding the Jamus Pueblo Orno Oven Bread. Here is a piece of that bread. Look how beautiful it is. And it is quite a piece of loaf of bread. Grandma already cut it open and had her French toast. I just wanted you to take a look at it. Isn't that beautiful? This is the best bread for French toast. So it comes out and it's round as I showed you before I cut it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. This is just a very short int uh, intro and to, just to let you know that we are going to have a nice little video on making French toast with the Hamas Pueblo bread. And Hamas in Navajo is Maite Shkij. And this itself, this is Kisani. Pueblos are called Kisani. And this is Kisani, Biba. That's what this is. This is Ba. If bih means it belongs to the Kisani, the Pueblos. So you say Kisani Biba. That's what this is. I love you and I hope you enjoy the video. I want to introduce you to a Pueblo type of bread. This is from the Jamus Pueblo. It's made in an Orno oven bread. You don't say the H. Or no oven bread. And you will see the oven as we are speaking about this. Here is the bread. It's a beautiful bread and it's made in this oven. It's beautiful. I have this sitting near a Hamas pottery. Look how beautiful this is. And they're not cheap, they're very expensive. So I wanted to introduce you to this bread. There's a reason why this is the best bread for French toast. Now grandma's going to take her knife. It has a sheath, make sure you always have that covered. And I am going to slice this. Um, it, it's a, I don't know if I have a, a knife long enough but I always keep the crust, you know, for later uh, so that it doesn't dry out. But I like to have my, my French toast quite thick. I, it, using this bread, it is absolutely lovely. So look how thick and it's beautiful. And what I do is I just cut that in half. Now we're just gonna prepare one because it's quite it's quite filling and I usually cut this in half and grandpa and I usually have uh, two each and I will just go ahead and make this. I know you all know how to make French toast. I'm going to show you this recipe. It is a French toast for four piece slices of bread. There's two eggs one teaspoon vanilla extract, a half a teaspoon ground cinnamon, and one quarter cup milk. I'm using two eggs. Now we're going to add a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Okay, so we're putting in a half a teaspoon or a teaspoon of vanilla extract. This is a half a teaspoon and we're going to use a ground cinnamon. Now we're going to put one quarter cup of milk. I'm, I am using almond milk. I love this almond breeze and it is what? Original. So there's no flavoring in there, no sugar, and we'll put that in. Now mind you, we're taking Pueblo bread, 
They put butter on it too. It's nothing unusual what we're doing. And so now we're going to mix this all up. And let's move our egg over here. And again, while grandma's mixing, here is the recipe. And it's a French toast recipe. And we're just going to mix this really good. Then we're going to dip our bread in here. We have the griddle. It's on at 375. And I decided to go ahead and go with four pieces of bread and our mixture here. So we are going to. And the one thing I do now, some people think, oh my goodness, I use olive oil, just a little bit of olive oil and uh, to grease, uh, you know, I don't know, it's up to you what, do you, what you want to do. So we're going to dip the wonderful Hamus bread into this mixture. And oh, you should smell. I love the smell of, of cinnamon. But we have a nice little breakfast and you can, you know, you don't have to always have all kinds of bacon. You know, you have your eggs here with your bread. Now we're, we will uh, eat this with our uh, syrup. And I love log cabin. And look at this, isn't that beautiful? You can butter it and now we're gonna butter it and enjoy how lovely that is. With our what? Grandma's favorite log cabin. And again, this is just simple dimple. It's Hamas Pueblo bread made into French toast. I hope you enjoy it and enjoyed the video. A fun food video. And uh, hopefully, if you come and see Grandma, we gotta have this, spend some time in a hotel or whatever, and we can make this for breakfast. Uh, if they don't serve breakfast, but irregardless, we'll enjoy it. Love you. See you. How going at?